fly higher tonight in this international showdown. James and Ray looking forward to this one. Both teams seem ready, and they are about to drop the puck on this opening faceoff. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. Sends the cross-ice pass. Shot right in front! Oh, we got a piece of it to keep it out. Oh, my goodness, what a hit! Look out! Protoss is looking for somebody to engage in a fight with. He can't find the right guy. Well, there's a couple of penalties called on the same play here, and both teams will lose a man for the next couple of minutes. Nietzsche wins the draw on their own end. Sends a pass over. Here's a short pass to Palat. To the front! Oh, what a stick save! There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play if you're not sure what's going on. Freeze the puck. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. Still no score in this one. Czech Republic's won the faceoff. Denies him with the save! Pass back to the point. Czech Republic's on the attack. Unloads from the blue line. Makes a save, cool and calm under pressure. And now he tries to get it across to Kasha. Team Belarus has got a hold of the puck now. Belarus gets a hold of it. They're looking to make something happen through the neutral zone now. Team Czech Republic's got a hold of it against the wall. Voracek swooping in on the attack. Quick feed down low. Comes up with a monster save in front. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Gains the zone from the right. Hard hit on the play. Wow, did he ever finish him hard. And when he dropped, he also dropped his stick. Now he's got to collect himself. Looks like a yard sale out there. And he makes a save on that play. Taken by Pasternak. Scores! They came, they saw, they took advantage of the rebound and score. Uh, goalie burps up this rebound here. It comes right back into the shooting area and the rebound is put away. Czech Republic's got the opening goal in this contest. So much time left, but it just feels better to play with the lead, and they must be pretty happy to score that quickly. And that doesn't exactly go take to take. Belarus steps inside. Wow, what a hit. Ray, you're at ice level. What do you see on that? It's not so much what you see, James, it's what you hear. You can really hear the pads crunching together. Makes it look easy with the stop. Handles a sweet feed. Hammers a shot. Denies him. He got all of it. Looks like we got a delayed tripping penalty coming up here. Time for the official to pass down his sentence. That penalty makes defending the lead a lot more difficult. But their penalty killers can be up to the task here. Belarus sends their man advantage unit out for the first time this evening. Great opportunity to get this game back to level of power play, trailing by one. This is a huge opportunity. Czech Republic's in transition. Slides it across. Oh, so close on that. Belarus gains a hold of possession. Through center. Driving right to the front, and he makes the save. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. Rips it from the blue line, makes the save with the trapper. Saka's ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. Team Belarus has got a hold of the puck. Quick 
feed to Protus. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Right in the slot. Tremendous stop by Riddick. Really good work. I like this chance here as they get the puck into a scoring spot. Goalie's just better on this time. Belarus oh. takes possession along the wall. Play whistle dead. Penalty coming up. A lot of focus on the penalty killers now. This is an important time with a one-goal lead. Belarus is set to go back to work on the power play. Power play looks great, but they've got to get inside those defensemen, fight for a rebound. Team Czech Republic's got it in the defensive zone. Voracek's got it into offensive territory. Oh, and that doesn't go well. Belarus with possession in their own zone. Team Belarus has got the puck against the boards. Team Czech Republic's penalty killers get a hold of it. Czech Republic's playing it through the neutral zone. Here's a blast. Stops the rocket of a shot. Here's a blast. Makes the save on the slapper. And the intensity's starting to ramp up here after that hit. Team Belarus's power play has some chances, but they still are down a goal. Denied that one. Sometimes you're in close, there's no room to put it anywhere. The goalie smothered it all. Grips it, rips it. Tremendous read and even greater sacrifice on the block. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. That penalty didn't go over very well right here beside me, James, on the bench. They know they're in tough now. Another power play opportunity coming up here. It doesn't really matter what the power play's done before you. You gotta have a short memory. What you have now is a power play right in front of you. Make sure you're focused in on what you're trying to accomplish. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. Protas is ready for the faceoff as we are about to resume this power play. Team Czech Republic's won the draw. Now he takes it over the line. Centering pass. He scores! What a cutter, but shorthanded! Teams are talking more and more about being aggressive when they're down a man. This is the result. Every once in a while, you're going to punch one through shorthanded. You've got to get rid of that puck in a hurry from that spot on the ice. You're in the high slot, you're open, but you know everybody's converging on you. Natchez is ready for the face-off as they'll continue to kill off this penalty. Things starting to get a little physical out there. Czech Republic's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. Team Czech Republic's moving it into the offensive end. Move to the middle. He scores! Another shorthanded marker. You don't see that often. No, they're not a very passive group killing penalties, are they? That's a couple of times where they've just taken advantage of a mistake and raced up the ice. Now, that's a goal scorer's goal right there, James. He establishes position low in the slot and zips the backhander past the goalie. Chance to reset here on the draw on this man advantage. Team Belarus has won the draw. Belarus looks to break out in their own end. Here comes the pushback. Palat's looking around for somebody to fight. He's going to have to go and fill the dance card somewhere else. He's struggling to get to the bench now, James. Uh, pretty clearly, he's going to need some help from the training staff. Belarus can't... Con he scores! I thought they were going to run out of time here, James. This is a terrific time to strike here. Now you carry over the intermission. You come out for the next period feeling really good about yourself. Everything today is the focus on being quicker. But once in a while, you get to move into a slap shot and he powders this past the goalie. Centers are set, face off, ready to resume play. Belarus is quick on the draw. 
And just a good old fashioned solid body check on the play. There's the buzzer, 20 minutes in the books, second period just around the corner. Samolski, Ray Ferraro bringing you all the action. Period number two is about to go. A one-sided affair after the first 20 minutes. Here we go for period number two. Oh, we'll get some tired defenders as icing is the call. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Czech Republic's turned this into a blowout, now leading by four. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. After the icing, now you've got the puck again. You can wear them down quickly. Feeds the puck across to Krejci. Czech Republic's got it along the wall. Stops them with a glove. Team Belarus has got a hold of the puck. Takes the feed from his own end. Break away. Yeah, beaten is the term, James. The goaltender beats the shooter on that one-on-one -on -one confrontation. Moves right to the middle. Oh, a clutch save. Takes the feed and serves up a little knock on the play. It's a chance on the rush. Two on one. And that's stopped by Riddick. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Moves it quickly over to Pasternak. Pass across to Sharon Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. Big open yes. ice hit. Was it ever? He really closed off the room. Nowhere to go. And icing waved off on this one. Really good hustle to get up the ice and beat the defender to the puck. Takes the feed. Gains the zone through the middle. There's a hit on the play. Aaron pass and they can't connect. Czech Republic's got the puck against the half wall. Scores! Wow! I think there might be smoke coming from the back of the net after that one timer. That is a bang bang play right there, James. That pass is on the tape and he doesn't stop and he one times it into the net. Team Czech Republic's brought it tonight. They absolutely have dominated here, especially with the goal scoring. They've been faster, they've played with more skill, and they are filling the net. What a fun night to play in. Quick shot. Oh, gets a little too much on it, and it sails high. Uh, he got a lot, of, a lot on the shot, and he's in good position, but he just shoots it up over top of the net. Belarus takes it across the line. Scooped up along the wall by Hurdle. Nice pass. Moves it to Hurdle. Puck scooped up by Foxa. And he comes up with it. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. Here in the back half of this period, Team Czech Republic's clicking on all cylinders tonight. They've added to the lead, and this is a total rout. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Hammers the shot. Scores! Well, things are going from bad to worse. The first goal, he's sitting on the bench in a ball hat. This guy can't stop the shot either. Team Czech Republic's come to play tonight. They continue to roll here in this second. You can tell which bench is having fun. They're standing up. The other guys are sitting down, hoping the coach doesn't notice them to put them back on the ice. And that's blocked. Czech Republic's got it behind the net. Here they come up along the wing. Moved in front. And that pass attempt is deflected. And now he angles it across to Gudis. Stoppage in play as the puck goes up and over. We'll get a face-off. Some last-second communication with the D as centers get ready to drop the puck. Team Belarus has won the face-off deep in their own end. Belarus plays it up the ice. 
Here he is, shot right in front. He was locked in there. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. Team Czech Republic's on the attack. Team Belarus has got the puck. My goodness, what a hit! You don't see hits like that anymore. The game goes so fast, but the defender got into great position and delivered wow. a devastating hit. And that one's broken up. Belarus plays it against the boards. Denies him with the pad. Riddick's had to do his part. He's had a good night in the goal, but at the other end, they've been really sharp around the net. Czech Republic's got the puck along the wall. He scores! Big goal from David Pasternak! That pass is perfect. I mean, James, I think you could probably receive that thing. It's right in the middle of the blade, flat and crisp. Off they go. Well, guys, he was able to make a great pass with his tape-to-tape -tape superstar ability, and it led to that goal right there. That was a great assist on the play. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Team Belarus has got the puck along the wall. Takes the pass. Team Belarus is in now. And that pass is redirected. Wrists one. Oh, what a paddle save on the play. Sometimes you make a good shot, and you just get beaten by the goaltender. I'd say that's one that you put in that category. And that somehow stayed out of the net. Here's a blast! Just wide! Well, two periods down and one more still to come. Third period action right after we get a clean sheet of ice. He's Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabolski, and we are ready to get this third period going. Here we go, third period set to get our way. Simply too much to not enough at this point. Receives the pass. Shimmick's got it across the line. Offside the call, we'll get a reset. Puck possession so critical, another face-off coming up here. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Team Czech Republic's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Denies him on the slobber. There's the whistle. We'll get a face off after the goalie covers up. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Well, that'll get a response. Yeah, after the teammate got hurt, he jumped right in. He's going to make him try and pay a price. We got ourselves a fight here. Nice effective use of the wrestling move. Yeah, you don't see that all the time, but this fight had punched itself out. Well, in this league, if you want to get in a punch in the face contest, you get kicked out as well. That'll be it for these two guys. Yeah, a little truculence goes a short way in this one as they'll say goodnight for this game. Team Belarus has got possession here in their own end. Takes it across the blue line. He's got a step! And that doesn't lead to anything. Apparently he wasn't open enough. He doesn't even really get a dangerous chance. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Slides it back to the blue line. Turns him away! And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. Pasternak's got a great shot, guys, but we know the key to getting it off so accurately is when he's got the puck settled and flat on the ice. That's when he can really use that snipe zone ability to really pick his spots. Oh, he laid a solid hit on him there. He was waiting for him and laid the shoulder right into him. That might loosen a few of the choppers on that play. Fires it! Big time stop! Pick 
picked up along the wall by Voracek. Oh, they do it again! Pinned up along the boards. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Team Czech Republic's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Picked off in the open ice. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Takes a hit on the play. Takes the feed at center. Sends the pass over. Way too much congestion blocks that. Simic's got it in the defensive end. Team Czech Republic's across the blue line. Quick pass to Piranha. What a save! He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. Steps into it. What a stop as he puts out the fire. Teams are lined up, and we are ready to take this draw. Belarus takes possession off the draw. And that pass can't connect. Team Belarus has got control of it now from their own end. Handles the puck. And that's picked off in the neutral zone. Oh, getting a little cheeky there. Natas shakes his head and declines this challenge. He's not interested. Well, a little bit of sorting out is going to have to happen here. Both officials are going to talk as there's more than one penalty on the play. Wins the draw in the neutral zone. Trying to engage a little physicality here. Team Belarus has got the puck here in the open ice. Oh, great save by Riddick. Belarus slides the puck against the wall. And things starting to ramp up a little bit now on the ice with that play. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And he takes a shot. He Oh, that's a really good shot. The goalie's down, and the puck goes up over top of him on the backhand. Team Czech Republic's added to their lead here in this third period. It's been nonstop. I like how they've scored and then gone after the next one, James. They've had their foot down on the gas pedal the whole night. Keeps hold of the puck. Rocked him along the wall. Belarus takes hold of the puck. They go on the attack through center. Move to the middle, and that one's broken up. Can't connect on the pass. Sends it in on the attack. Team Belarus is looking to break out of their own end. And that's intercepted, and they'll go on the attack. Czech Republic's really stomping all over these guys. A lot of it is that when they don't have the puck, they get it back so fast. Moves it around along the half wall. Scoops up the puck now. Gains the zone through center. And he regains control of the puck. Denies him in front. I thought they worked the puck around pretty good here. They get a good chance on goal, but not to be. Official signals for the players to get into position, and we're about ready to drop the puck. Belarus has it in their own end. There's another for the hit parade. Bronix carrying it ahead. Grips it and rips it, makes the save. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Belarus with a big defensive zone face off. And now he moves it to Sharon Kovich. Less than 60 seconds to play in this blowout. Czech Republic's got a hold of it along the wall. Here they come on the attack. Here's the pass with the stop. I think it's a chance for a breather here as he hangs on and covers the puck up. Who, for the players or for you? Well, you know, I won't complain.
Belarus wins the faceoff. Tries to get it to Sharangovich. Sends it across the ice. Belarus plays it along the boards. And puts the body into it, a little bumper car hockey. Team Czech Republic's got it into the offensive zone. To his teammate! Not happening. Back to the blue line. Big time stop there. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Belarus wins the draw. Ref's arms in the air. We got a penalty coming up. There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. Oh, there's players all over the place muddling around trying to figure out who's going to the penalty box because it's more than one of them. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Stops them again! Quick reflexes. You make one, you make two stops before the puck is cleared away. Here he is, takes the shot! And that's all she wrote from this one tonight! They say the goaltender that gets the hottest in the playoffs is usually the team that wins it. Boy, you don't want to peek too soon, but this is impressive, Ray. Yeah, I noticed you didn't say anything about it during the last couple minutes because you were worried about the jinx. jinx. There is no jinx. You're 150 feet away from the net. He played fantastic, and his streak continues. Are you saying broadcasters can't have an impact no, on a game? No. Oh. In the meantime and in between time, he's Ray. I'm James. Good night. <laughs>